This is D, and let's stress for life, that's what's up. Many people don't believe it when I tell them that I have a pet. I'm not talking about my beautiful chocolate lab. I'm not talking about my beautiful ebony cat who continually harasses my dog. I got issues with that. That's right, cat lovers, I got issues with that. I'm talking about my pet spider. Yeah, interestingly though, it got away from me. And it's burrowed itself inside the inside the wood pile. But what's so impressive to me is that my spider has created an incredibly large web. And it has other it has another extension on it. Is that incredible in its in and of itself? No, not necessarily. But what is so incredible to me is the fact that this web has so many different points. Now, what I'm saying to you is that you probably need to consider being like the spider. No, I'm not talking about praying on the weak and sucking the life out of them. No, that's not what I'm talking about. I am talking about having solid connections. The unfortunate thing is for so many individuals, the reason why their lives, their, their lives fall apart on them is because they only have one, two or a few connections. But you look at my spider, you look at its web, several, several connections. And those connections may be human being. Oh, no, they need to be people, period, because people need people. We'll talk about that in a moment. But not only do people need people, but people need various things to help them manage, manage the issues of life. One thing that's highly significant, good exercise. Another thing that's highly significant, good rest. See what happens if you don't get good rest. You're talking about some of the most stupid. No, no. <laughs> I guess I need good rest. You're talking about some of the stupidest things in life that can occur. Don't get that good rest and see what happens. Another thing, be well hydrated. The brain is comprised of what? 70 some odd percent water. See what happens if you're not drinking enough water. Dumb decisions will ensue. So stay hydrated, not not with coffee, because what does coffee do? Coffee actually dehydrates you. Tea actually dehydrates you. Um, cola drinks actually dehydrate. I should say caffeinated drinks actually dehydrate you. Are you getting the trend? Additionally, let education be one of your one of your connection points. Um, and my brothers and my sisters. I am never, ever going to say that you need to dismiss spirituality. In fact, as I talk about spirituality, for those individuals who claim Christ, how many connection points did he have? Most certainly he had the father, but on earth, how many connection points did he have? He had 12 disciples. And of those 12 disciples, he was very close to three of them. And of the three, he was even closer to the one. In fact, the one he was the closest to was actually the most, the most violent brother around. I'm talking about John. Those are the individuals that Jesus had as his points of contact, as his connections. Now, my brother, my sister, as stated earlier, life is going to come at you. Life is going to come at you really quick, fast, and hard. You put all the various plans in place that you want. Life is going to come at you and it's going to change up those plans in ways that you would have never imagined. When those things do occur, let's say the storms of life actually blow your nest down or blow your blow your excuse me, blow your um your web down completely. I've heard of too many individuals who something happens they lose almost all of their connections. As this one sister that I talked to, beautiful sister I talked to said, you have to be willing to reinvent yourself. You may have to go into another different part of the forest or, or as my spider did, go into another different part of the house, another section of the wood pile and reinvent yourself. 
but reinvent yourself, reestablish those connections and, and allow yourself to be that much stronger than before. Make sure that you spread your net, that you make your connections on things that are stable, on things that are sturdy, and on things that can sustain you, not only now, but from, from, from now on. I know this is kind of a touchy issue, but I hope, I hope you, <laughs> I hope you get the point. Anyway, make sure you like, subscribe, comment, share. Also, click the notification bell so you can be notified of our next video. Lastly, go to www.destressmethod.com for more resource information. Well, that's all we got for now. This is D, and let's stress for life. That's what's up. Peace.